We all remember the horror of going to the principal's office. The intimidation and the fear of authority could make enough, be enough to make you quiver. But Whitney Wiles shows us how one Montgomery County educator is changing that thinking and putting a new spin on the principal's role. Good morning. At Olney Good Elementary. Morning. Good morning, how are you? Good morning. Before class even starts. How are you doing today? Most students have already been to the principal's office. Thumbs up? No, not the room <laughs> itself. We'll change shoes throughout the day. But a more accessible space. We are mobile. Two years ago, Carla Glaw traded her desk and chair for a metal television cart. I have my laptop, walkie-talkie radio, got our hallway compliments, I've got high fives. From the first bell to the last, you can find her Redskins adorned cart. Careful as you come down this ramp. In this hallway. Morning. Or that one. Oh, that's, you're doing a graph. She knows almost every student's name. Good morning, Julia, where are you headed? Sees their struggles. How's your foot, how's your foot from yesterday? Here's their accomplishments. You get to talk to the kids and find out, hey, I moved up uh, a reading level, Mrs. Glaw. A notion so infectious, her assistant principal has given up her office, too. All right. A lot of it is about being innovative. So it's just like thinking out of the box in terms of how we can be more efficient. For students, it's a benefit beyond efficiency. That every time I walk by, she says, good morning, Joy. She's a very nice principal. And she's helping people. Don't be that I feel like I'm a good person. And when you see that reaction, it seems leaving the office behind was her best move. We are building relationships with kids. Whitney Wilde. That's absolutely what I love about being mobile. News Channel 8.